we know your work, epic work with Beyonce. I mean, hello, iconic. Thank you. Um, so that being said, mm -hmm. in terms of this performance and this week, now being on So You Think You Can Dance yeah. for you, how do you feel? You know, honestly, I feel like this was meant to be, you know, Beyonce just gave me a, a nice platform to do something that I really love. And I think So You Think is just like the second chapter and just yes. working with Hanale and Cole and then bringing this kind of party vibe that I come from in the stepping and strolling world, just putting it back on the map in a really powerful way. Um, it's just incredible. So thank you to everyone. Hopefully I'll be back to yes. like choreograph more because it was such an awesome, ex awesome experience. Yes, I mean, we hope you will as well. I love that you get to put your spin, your voice, your culture, like everything into showcasing these dancers. And then for you as a choreographer and as a performer and artist, what is something that helps you stay grounded, something that keeps you authentically you, um, whether that be taking class, whether it be watching performances for you, journaling? Totally. I'm in class all the time. Like people, yes. if you know Joe Brown, you know I'm in class training yes. in all styles. And I like to incorporate that yes. into stepping and strolling as well. So Amazing. taking class and then just surrounding myself with a team of friends and family that will always just keep me grounded and keep me focused. And that's honestly why I'm here because of the circle that I have. So thank you guys. Yes, yeah. that support system is so important totally. and always being gracious and the gratitude that you find. Yes. I say when you acknowledge the abundance, more comes to you. And so that's so true. We, it will happen. Sage it's advice. gonna be, yes, it'll happen for you uh, amazingly. Thank you so much. Um, and then lastly for us, what, what's your big, who is your biggest inspiration in terms of dance? Or what is a quote that you can give dancers out there, performers out there? Um, yeah. Well, I'll give you two. Okay. So biggest dance inspiration is my older sister. Shout out to Kiara. Um, she told me all of my moves growing up. Um, but she really inspired me because she actually had scoliosis growing up. And the doctors told her that she would never dance again. And so she pushed through that and she performed on Broadway. She's on Broadway. So just watching that and then kind of growing up underneath that kind of sunlight, if you will, just kind of inspired me to just keep going. Despite what anyone tells you, you can still do it. So shout out to my older sister. I love it. The and power of the mind and the spirit. Yeah, it's so incredible. And then I think a quote that I always like keep with me is, reality is wrong, dreams are for real. That's why Tupac Shakur. Um, <laughs> I was just going to say, that's a Tupac <laughs> lyric. Come on. Um, I've been keeping that with me so long. And this is just a true testament of those words. Beautiful. Even though it was reality TV, but yeah. this is where dreams are made. So, so you think, great job. <laughs> I love your intention. I love what you bring to the stage. Thank you for your energy. Thank you, Thank you so for much. your time. Wonderful meeting you. Thank you, bro. <laughs>